So we know season two is in the early stages of pre-production, but tell me everything. <laughs> I still gonna. <laughs> what else are we seeing at Lumen? Are we gonna see a different department? Are who's the new cast coming in? Uh, I, I, I mean, yeah, we, we kill off all the major characters in the first minute. Okay. Uh, that's Great. all I can tell you. Oh my God. That's cool. also not true. <laughs> well, it's really hard to talk about because you want to let it be, you know, we don't want to have spoilers. But it's, I think that where the series leaves off at the end of the first season, there's a lot of questions that are then brought up. So we're, you know, we're going to get into the answers, hopefully, some of those. But, you know, hopefully in a way that also allows for new questions. Okay. But you know, you can't you can't say what, anything else. <laughs> and lots of people haven't seen the show yet. So exactly. You know, That's the thing. Okay. I don't know how to talk about it because I want people to not be you know to know right. the spoilers. I mean, it's a very mysterious show. Like you really can't figure out what's going on until you get to the very end. Right. So I do know that John Turturro was very adamant about Christopher Walken joining the cast. What about you guys? Are you guys like texting Ben and being like, yo? We need, or you like, are you texting Dan? What's going on? Like, we need this person to be on the show for the next season. Do you guys have a dream add-on? I said I wanted a romance with Jennifer Lopez. <laughs> Please tell me. I wasn't coming it's, back without her. By the way, that's Jen's Jennifer Affleck now. Sorry. All right. Oh, oh, right. Oh, oh. Hey, Jeff Goldblum. I was gonna. Say, I, I heard that, so I was gonna say I'm gonna rely on you to get Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> okay. All right. Now it's fantastic. Yeah. Anyone else wish list? What, like, let's just manifest it now. I mean, we're hoping uh, if we are at the Emmys, I, I don't know if Obama's going to be there. I know he is nominated <laughs> also. <laughs> and I just think he's I, nominated for, for him, narrating uh, uh, the National Parks right. thing. Yes. Yeah. But so I just think he could be good. New character, Barry To narrate. Yeah, Barry O. <laughs> Save that. Okay. He has no idea he was president. <laughs> <laughs> at any point when creating the show, was were you guys nervous that Elon Musk might be inspired by the show? L legitimately, Whoa. yes. <laughs> Have you gotten any weird calls yet? Not yet, not yet. I don't think he calls. I think he just like beams his consciousness into you in your dreams. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, uh, it, it, it is it, it is something I, uh, where you, you worry, you're like, I hope no crazy multi-billionaire gets any ideas from this show. Yeah. But he is developing that chip, right? He's one of the, that is similar to the mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, when I was watching the show, I was like, this is it. This is the future. Here we go. Yeah. Well, and we worked with a real brain surgeon to, who is the brain surgeon in the show. And, and he kept saying, he's like, my mom's going to be so proud of me that I'm on TV. And I'm like, no, you have the proud job. Yeah. <laughs> Would any of you be able to map out the set? At some point, but it kept shifting is the thing. Like that's why like we would be walking around and get lost and like I think that's why John's not here. Is, uh, <laughs> so so I, I I think because it's always shifting, probably not. You read that you would get lost if you had yeah. to yell Adam. Yeah, it, more than once I, I would get lost because those hallways that you see on the show, you actually have to walk down those hallways to get to the office set. But like Dan said, David shift them around depending on what we were shooting so you would be walking for five minutes and it hit dead end and meanwhile you're like going to be late to sit. so I would just have to yell out that someone needs to come find me yeah. <laughs> so how do they find you? Was someone overlooking like alright go left really go right sound, like just the voice like yeah. you listen to the voice Marco Polo. But, but also the wellness area where her character is Casey is that, that was where the actors would hang out a lot while they were waiting to go into the other set. So, like, you walk by wellness, you see like all these actors just like reading and on their phones. <laughs> but it felt like kind of like just like a green room. Yeah. And then, but yet with like the weird painting of the four temples, right? Staring at them. 